You might blame your pets for shedding all over the house, but we humans do it too, and our stuff is alive. This is Scientific American's 60 Second Science. I'm Christopher Intagliata. Got a minute? We're constantly emitting microbes around us, and this is coming from shedding of our skin, from exhaling, um, you know, our hair, and we're, we're just full of these guys. Adam Altrichter, a microbial ecologist at the University of Oregon. We've never been sterile organisms. We are definitely uh, masses of microbes, uh, both in and on us. Biologists estimate we shed a million particles an hour, including, of course, a lot of bacteria. Altrichter and his colleagues wanted to measure that cloud of particles. So they asked 11 volunteers not to shower, dressed them in shorts and tank tops, and put them in a sterile chamber for hours at a time while collecting microbial samples on surfaces and in the air. What they found in those samples was a menagerie of bacteria from the volunteers' skin, guts, genital tracts, lungs, noses, and mouths. And for eight of the 11 study subjects, the microbial cloud was unique enough to identify the individual who'd left it, suggesting that this bacterial fingerprint could someday be used in forensics. The study is in the journal Peer J. Given that we spend 90% of our lives indoors, our microbial clouds also colonize the places we live and work, and yes, the people around us. It's just kind of interesting to think about how the people that we interact with in, at work or in classrooms or other environments, how we could be sharing some of these microbial passengers between us, uh, not even knowing anything about it. And now that you do know about it, hopefully your view of your coworkers won't become clouded. Thanks for the minute. For Scientific American's 60 Second Science, I'm Christopher Intagliata.